Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. You're here with Soppy and this is Soppy Stage. And if you're back here again, hopefully, then you know why you're here and you know what we're doing here. And uh, yeah, you're here for some more fun on the Friday evening, Friday just before the weekend. So let's enjoy the next 10 minutes and yeah, you can carry on with plans for the weekend. Hopefully something exciting. So today, uh, trying to be a little bit different, you know, always as much as I can, uh, you know, I still get, have a lot. I still got a lot to go through with my Shein outfits, but I also have ordered some stuff from a new app called Light in the Box. And that was also because there were like loads of stuff on there. Like I'm trying to constantly find new interesting stuff. So if you do know of something, do let me know, uh, you know, we'll try some new things. But what I decided to do today is a uh, skirt. So, you know, you've seen a lot of my bikinis already. You've seen a lot of lingerie. Let's see if we can find some sexy skirts that I can probably use on a night out or an evening out. And yeah, we'll crack on straight on to the outfits. I'll start with the first one being the one from Light in the Box, mainly because it's in this bag and it makes a lot of noise. And uh, yeah, I want to get it out of there as quickly as possible. Right, ooh, he's got panties. If you call that panties. <laughs> okay, right. Shiny little dress, fetishy look. Right, looking at it, it's a very, very simple, uh, simple skirt. Nothing too special, a little zip on the side. Turn it around though, and becomes a little bit naughty. This is definitely not for going out. This is for after you've gone out and you've come back home. Not alone ideally like let's crack on and try it on so right an interesting skirt not too bad um i must say it definitely feels that it's very cheap <laughs> it's not too expensive material it's um i'm not sure how long it can last it is very thin so it's definitely not for <laughs> cold evening you gotta keep warm um and what can i say shiny fetishy look very interesting back i do like it uh, I think, well, it, it is adjustable, so I would say you can adjust it on the back and make it look as sexy as you want and as revealing as you want. I like the fact that there's panties, although they're not very comfortable, uh, I wouldn't say it's something I would use. It just feels like there's a string up your bum and that's all about them. Uh, and you can't really see them once you have the skirt on anyway, so you'd rather put something that's you more comfortable with. Uh, one thing uh, I can't really get rid of is the lines that were caused by the fact that the skirt was uh, folded in transit. So you can't really get rid of that and it's a little bit annoying, I wouldn't lie. Uh, but overall I guess uh, when you're trying some kind of cheap outfits to have a sexy evening in home or maybe even uh, a photo shoot, like I'll probably try to use this in a photo shoot, then that could really suit. You just need to go and find the right top for it, uh, which I don't think that the one I currently have is the perfect for it, but it's still something that we can get away with.
outfit number two. We're moving on to the Shein collection because they do have three of them. And I did order them so long ago, I don't even remember how they look like. So I'm a little bit excited to try them. Oh yes, this feels right. So this feels like leather. This was more expensive than the first skirt that I tried. It doesn't mean that it is. It's probably not leather. It's definitely not leather. It can't be. They're too cheap for it. It's got 45% leather. Is that... Is that... Wow, well, I'm surprised. Let's crack on and try it on and see how it looks. Okay, right. So as you can see, uh, a simple shorter. Much shorter than the first one skirt. What I really like about this is like, well, I'm really surprised that it's half of it is leather, 50, almost 50% leather, um, and polyester, fine. Um, I think it looks so sexy. Um, it's probably something that I should somehow manage to try on the bike. A bike shoot, definitely. Motorbike, that is, not a bicycle, by the way. I have read some of the comments. Um, and yeah, um, it does look really, really sexy. I like the fact that um, you've got like something like a belt, but it's really part of the design of the skirt. And then it reveals uh, a bit of the skin on the hip. And it's just really sexy. And again, that design, like I've said before, when it looks like there's straps around your body, uh, it makes it so edgy. It's so cool. Again, it's a bit of a fetishy look, but a bit more classy. Uh, something that will give a bit of a mm to an outfit and with the right top, maybe even a shirt. I would say a white shirt or a bright shirt or something it would look so cool. There's a zip on the back. Um, yeah, it is on the back. I would say maybe it could have been on the side or a little bit more discreet. It's quite obvious, but still, overall, this is a pretty damn good outfit. And we're moving on to yet another sheet in and that doesn't seem like there's a lot in that bag <laughs> I like the fact I love the fact in fact that she in put all of your things in these super sexy bags and they're really reusable and really really comfy oh well, comfy comfy bags yeah it's quite handy I'd say this is outfit number three is that a skirt that looks interesting Probably can be worn as a top as well. Um, hmm, gotta try that later on. Anyway, trying it on right away. So, pretty good. Uh, again, it's um, made in China and you gotta always worry when something comes from China because they're tiny in there, they're so skinny uh, and the sizes usually don't correspond. This is a nest size skirt and it fits nice. It sits nicely on the hips and on the body. Again, again straps on the side my favorite little thing to have straps here and there especially on the hips because it kind of shapes your curves more it shows off the skin but then it covers it as well and it makes it super sexy 
uh, the skirt is not too long but it's not too short either uh, the material is cheap definitely cheap material but really for what you're getting you you are paying great um, oh. <laughs> but really for what you're paying you're getting great quality um, and great look really um, yeah nice little sexy outfit that I would definitely try on on some photo shoots and I love the fact that it's black because black is just so neutral and so like sexy you know Right, so we are now on outfit number four. Yes, there's four outfits today, as uh, because we're just doing the bottoms, so I thought I'll give you a little bit more time on these today. And yeah, this one I saved for the end because that was the one I remember I ordered. I know what I've ordered because I really couldn't wait for it to arrive. I haven't tried it on yet, so I'm really scared how it's gonna look like. I haven't opened the bag yet. <laughs> it's uh, okay. Right. Uh, wait, that's an interesting skirt. <laughs> okay, the first thing I'm not seeing straight away is that this is plastic and it's very obviously plastic. Again, it serves it per its purpose to create that design. Um, I wish it wasn't plastic, but still. Let's crack on and try it on. Okay, this skirt is not too short yeah it looks very short <laughs> i don't know what it is about it it just feels like it's short uh, probably because it goes quite highly on the waist um and because it's so flowy and free and uh, it kind of feels like you got more skin on the show than you actually do um i always kind of like had to constantly keep on checking to see <laughs> if it hasn't gone up or something um anyway on the side it is open and it reveals the leg completely so you don't need to wear some underwear, I guess. Wait that. <laughs> or not. Um, and yeah, overall it's a sexy little dress. Uh, dress, little skirt. Um, it's, I like the effect that it creates, especially with the uh, belt design um, and the front as well. Uh, it is nice and sexy. It's a bit more gothic rather than fetishy. Um, I wouldn't say it's what I expected, but it is quite good. I'll have to try it on a photo shoot um, when I find the right theme. Maybe it could be something Halloween-y. Halloween's around the corner now. So maybe it's something along these lines if you want to dress like a sexy witch, possibly.
So that was it for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know which is your favorite skirt. Thinking back on it, I really like the second one. Uh, probably because it made me think of my, of my motorbike yet again. Uh, but yeah, um, I do think that they were all kind of sexy in their own little way. Um, they were not too expensive. So I went to Shein and Light in the Box. So these are the two apps that I used for this video. If you want to have a look at the updates, you can always go and have a look and see what you like on there or recommend something else. And yeah, please like and subscribe. Please, please, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, it really helps me. I really appreciate it. And it will mean that you really enjoyed the video, which I hope you did. Please go on Patreon uh, if you want to see more. Uh, I will be on there more and more often. And yeah, hope you enjoy. To the next week. Have a nice weekend.